the graph of a function given here. Now we are asked to divide the closed interval negative 1 through 5 into three equal solve intervals. Okay, and draw the corresponding rectangles using the left endpoints of each solve interval. So we want to divide negative 5 through 6 the, and the equal width of each rectangle will be let's say delta x negative 1 to 5 the length will be 6 because pi minus negative 1 b minus a over how many 3 6 divided by 3 is 2 okay so the width of each rectangle will be 2 and we have to go from negative 1 through 5 using left endpoints okay left endpoints so you start from negative 1 uh, 2 units so that's the first second and here we go th 3 and we go all the way to 5 but we already have 3 places for the height of the rectangles okay so now let's draw the rectangles from negative 1 go all the way up to the curve so that's here the height 5 and draw a parallel to x-axis from here so that's the first rectangle of width 2 and height based on negative 1 from negative from 1 we go up to the curve that's here and draw another rectangle so this is the width height will be from this part so just 1 from 3 we go up to the curve which is here and draw a parallel to x-axis and that's the third rectangle so negative 1 through 5 we divided we divided into three rectangle three parts three equal sub intervals and with two here you go so the heights of the rectangles were determined using the left end points here here and here go up to the curve draw parallel to x-axis from here go up to the curve parallel to this so we got three rectangles okay that's what we have to do in part a now in part b evaluate the Riemann sum that means the sum of the areas of these three rectangles same thing okay left hand points so l3 Riemann sum using the left hand points 3 l3 or don't have to write this notation uh, what is uh, that's will, that will be always width delta x times heights sum of the heights evaluate the function at negative 1 evaluate at the 1 at 3 in fact you don't need this step because we already know the area of this rectangle the width is 2 height is 5 so the area of this rectangle is 10 2 times 1 2 10 2 and 2 so 14 14 square units is the answer but this is the formal way to write delta x is 2 height from negative 1 that's 5 this height plus from 1 this height is just 1 and this is also 1 so 7 plus 2 14 square units okay final